Hey guys, today I have a little haul video. Um, I'm going to talk about these two things really quick before I do the other stuff. Um, I found, I've been wanting to try hair chalk for a while, but every every kind I've seen has been expensive and if I didn't like it, I didn't want to spend that much on it. So I found, because um, all the Halloween stuff is out now, these Fright Night ones. Um, they had so many colors. They had red, green, purple, black, um, I don't know if there was yellow or not. But I got the blue and the pink. Um, they're from Fright Night, which I know, I don't know if it's just a Rite Aid thing. I think a lot of drugstores carry that brand, but uh, the blue one is called Cryptic Blue, and the pink one is R.I. Pink. Um, so I tried the blue one the other night, and it actually works really good, which I'm excited about. It just comes in a little case like this, and it looks like an eyeshadow. Um... And basically all you do is, wherever you're going to put it in your hair, you just, uh, I'm going to get it all over my hands too, you just kind of hold your hair on the top and then drag this through your hair. And the blue is cool because I've tried to dye my hair blue so many times and it just comes out. It'll come out and then the first time you wash it, it looks horrible, so this is a good way to have blue hair and it looks kind of chunky, but um, then you just spray it with hairspray to set it and it washes out the first time you wash your hair, so. Um, I know sometimes it, if you have like bleached hair, it, it'll probably stain it for a couple of washes, so whether you want that or not is a different story, um, and it comes off comes off easy. I just used a makeup wipe to take it off. Um, but yeah, so I haven't even opened the pink one yet, but I'll probably do a blog post about them. Now I have a little blue streak in my hair. Where did it go? My hair is pretty uh, light now to begin with. I haven't dyed it in so long, so this is pretty much my natural color. The other thing I'm going to talk about is the... Rimmel Extra Pop Lash Mascaras. Now, I got all of these because they were on sale. Um, there's only four colors. I know the Maybelline ones had like, I think there was six colors. Um, these that I've talked about already. But uh, supposedly these worked better, so I wanted to try them out. So, I'll probably insert pictures as I'm talking about this, uh, about these. Uh, pictures of them on my eyelashes. This is a boring one. It's just a black, but the thing with these also is they don't just color your lashes like the Maybelline Great Lash ones do. They're supposed to um, build up your lashes as well and give them some volume because they're called lash building mascara. So uh, this is just a plain black. Uh, it's actually pretty decent. And you know what? I didn't even put mascara on when I did my makeup, so I will show you. So, it's pretty, pretty decent for, I think it was like, uh, they were buy one, get one half off, so it was like three something to begin with, so the second one was, like when you buy two, the second one was like $1.74, so pretty good cheap mascara. Um, and then for the colors, these are just fun colors. Um, this one is pop, pop purple and it looks like this. It's just kind of a light purple color. And these, it, this one's a lot lighter than the, the Maybelline one. I'll show you. This is the purple one. And this one's just so dark that you can barely see it when it's on your lashes, especially if you have dark lashes. I'm sure if you had brown lashes, I mean, um, blonde lashes, this would show up much better. Um, and people have suggested using, like, the white, um, one of the white eyelash primers before you put 
the colored mascara on. I haven't done that yet, but I'm sure that'll help it pop more too. But this is lighter, so it shows up better. And I'm just gonna, I'll do a little swatch of it on my hand so you can see. It's kind of like a thick consistency mascara. But it's nice, it doesn't like clump or anything, so that's a plus. Then we have Pop Green. And this is like a bright green. I think this one is like the easiest to get to show up on dark lashes. So I'll show you this one. There's the green. And then this is my favorite one, Pop Turquoise. And it's actually a lot lighter than what you think it is. It's more of like a light blue color, but it's really pretty. Oh, this one doesn't want to come off. And this one's like shimmery too, which is kind of cool. It doesn't want to focus. So, um, that's it. That was just <laughs> my random uh, Halloween excursion stuff that I bought. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to you next time.